So I have the Garmin 4Runner 255 and in today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to turn off, how to turn on and also how to restart your Garmin 4Runner 255. So the first thing you want to do, I'll be showing you the first method. So the first method is to press this for about uh, three to five seconds. So this light button here. So just press for a few seconds and you should see this menu. Now this is a menu you can actually cycle through using up or down button, as you can see. And what you want to do is make sure the power icon is aligned to this button. And then press this button. And that gives you the uh, power menu. If you want to turn off, simply scroll down to make sure yes is selected. And then press this button. And that's going to power down or switch off your Garmin uh, 4Runner 255. Now, to turn on the watch, let's just wait about 10 seconds. So to turn the watch back on, simply press this for, again, a couple of seconds, maybe two or three seconds. Like that, you should see that faint triangle. That means the watch is starting, so just allow it to boot. Might take a couple of seconds there. There you go. So the watch is back up and running. Now to restart basically means what you've just done, just switching off and switching back on. Now in case you want to force a restart, which basically means you want to force a shutdown and then restart normally, in case the watch is unresponsive and you're not able to get to this menu, this one right here, in case you're not able to get here, then you can do a uh, forced restart. Okay, so let me just quickly go back. Now, what you want to do is on that same button, this one right here, instead of pressing and holding for two seconds, you can do that for 15 seconds. Okay, so this light button, press and hold for about 15 seconds. So let's go, press and hold. Let's keep, let's keep holding, keep holding, keep holding, keep holding. There you go. The watch goes off. You can see it's completely off, as you can see. And you've basically what you've done is forced a shutdown. So now to restart the watch again, just press this button for a couple of seconds until you see that uh, faint triangle. There you go. It comes up, and that means the watch is booting. And all you need to do now is wait for it to boot up. And those are the two different ways of uh, turning the watch off and on and also how to restart your watch uh, in case you encounter some problems, uh, a forced restart, so to speak. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below, and good luck.